The warmest of welcomes to you. We await the conclusion of the pre-game formalities. And our live game is Real Madrid against Alaves. This is Peter Drury and I'm happy to inform you that Jim Beglin has joined me to offer his expertise. Well, thanks, Peter. There's a great sense of anticipation in this stadium. I've been hit by it too. Two starting lineups. So we're up and running. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? It has to be the brains of the operation, Tony Kroos. He's another one of the elite passers in world football and his consistency remains high at, at both club and international level and one of the first picks in the team. Yeah, I'd have picked him too. No doubt the fans feel much the same way. Deflected behind for a corner. Fence has got rid of that. And the volley. And that's off target. There wasn't much on for him, so it was worth a shot. It was worth a try from there. Well, that should set them on their way and get into a nice rhythm. The early signs are very encouraging now. Good running with the ball, can they build on it? There were better options before the ball was lost. Easy to save from up here, I know. Morata. It's come loose. Danger averted for now. That's a throw. Bruce with the cross. He's gone for it! Disappointing finish in the end. That is a poor kick by the keeper. Being intercepted. to get it forward quickly a real chance to break Isco did well to emerge with the ball that's a contest to keep an eye on Morata a chance it's one goal Real Madrid and Real Madrid are ahead well, from right in front of goal, there was no way he was going to miss. It's almost criminal to see a defence fail to identify someone who thrives when it comes to shooting stats. They knew, and yet they didn't heed, and they've paid the price and deserve to. Real Madrid, draw first blood here. Listen, when it comes to goals, Peter, in this team, he's always the number one contender, and he's done it again. Now the cross. It's a brilliant interception. Chance. He's off on a marauding run. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Well, it was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. Gomez! That's a fine save. Well, I thought his starting position was good and that helped the keeper to judge the flight of the ball and, and deal with it well. Thrust towards the front line. Oh, I 
Let's open up nicely for him. It was all about the quality of the delivery and they come away with nothing. Cristiano Ronaldo. Who's ball? Who's going to get there? And it's half time here. Any strong opinions on the first half? Well, they're playing a game of wait and wallop. Uh, let the opposition have the possession and, and defend in numbers. Uh, and then wallop hit them hard. Um, and fight. Leading a cagey game here. It's had its moments. And it's 1 0 at the break. Real Madrid carry a one goal lead into the second half. Tony Kroos has the route one option. Real Madrid get it back again. Some astute defending to ensure they got no further. Seems now to be all about wit. Well, when you have the personnel to create in wide areas, then they need to see as much of the ball as possible. He's got away with one there. There's going to be a change here. There's a man waiting to come on. Pumps it upfield. Oh, good interception. Tony Cross gets his foot in there. The referee's awarded a free kick. broken through can he find a finish now oh and they really should have been made to pay oh look I don't need to tell you that that is not a good area to lose possession in and should it be repeated I think there's a real chance that the next time they're going to be punished for it <laughs> Tony Kroos Spoon forward. Who's going to make this theirs? Great run this. He's covered quite a distance. Marcelo goes long and forward. Cristiano Ronaldo is effectively being marked out of the game here. Yeah, and getting on the score sheet has clearly made him a marked man now. There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Promising cross. Plays it out to the wing. 
Sergio Ramos gets into the right position to intercept. Out to the left it goes. Dashing forward at pace. Gets up to head it! And he's there to hoof it away. Defending, albeit from an unexpected source. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition. And I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. Cristiano Ronaldo. And the counter is on. Chance. Massive leap. He has done it. And with that goal comes comfort. A lovely header, but really it was all about the delivery. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. Alaves decided now is the time to make their final change. And that's it. Real Madrid claim victory here, and on balance they were worth it. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? There's a solidity about them, almost as if they set up not to lose and see how things unfold. That eases the pressure on the strikers, who can afford to be patient, and it's all paid off. That's it for today. Thank you, Jim, and goodbye.